Alright. in your trunk and none in the bag.
So the reception is trying to hunt down Diane. Nobody can find her, and the lady that must be in charge of when people come and go just said to the receptionist, Diane isn't back yet. I've told all of them to be back by one after lunch, so nobody can find Diane. As usual, this is what they do. Joan Stone had to run by and uh, give us all dirty looks. Jennifer had to run through and give us all dirty looks. And the security guard is standing guard again in front of the door just because we're here. end up getting changed to mine now. I had to go through a big huge thing to get my address changed to here at the post office. I don't know. I don't even look at the address. I just see it's changed and send it upstairs. I don't know. This is yours. This is yours. Huh? 
Yeah, he's. Yeah. Now it's coming here. Who has the right to change? I had to go in and get my that could be like license and everything. Is that yeah, how do you know where it's from? I, think it's from I don't know why my son Nathan Banks is connected to my name or address who's doing this. I had to go in and show him license and everything to change my address. He's not at the shelter with us, but now that's what it's going to look like. I don't know who keeps doing this stuff. Who has authority? Yeah, she's got to get the keys. She's going to go in the over so we can all have the shelf. I'll be right back. Oh. All right, I have to go to the jail to get the county car, and then I'll come and pick you up. Okay. Now, one of us, Gregory forgot his phone. We were there Friday. We had to clean up. Apparently, Diane said an inspector is supposed to be going over. Oh. So we all, well, the three of us, um, the three of these guys, we went over just to straighten up, move some boxes and stuff, and he just forgot his phone. Yeah. But uh, my SIM card is in his phone now because my battery completely died. The electric fried my phone completely from when all the water went all over. There's electric that's affected over there. The washer and dryer won't work. So I had to put my SIM card in his phone, but he forgot his phone over there. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. He got more of a lot of stuff happens. Oh, yeah, yes. We work a lot on focus, focus. <laughs> they can't help us. <laughs> we still love you. <laughs> Yep. You're a good guy. Sit there long enough, I would have 
not made it down yet. I don't even know if it's open. Mm -hmm. But I'm assuming any time now, because it's closed out, right? You know? I assume today is the last day. Yeah. We'll just have to see. There's a um, small pond up there by the Buena Vista. We're going to go check out. It's a lot closer than the, than the pool. <laughs> okay. We'll see if they can cool off in that. That's right there um, behind the hospital. They have um, like trails and stuff back there. Other than being homeless? No, not right now. <laughs> We're working on it. <laughs> so the cars are all over. Public safety, we have to park them. Once in a while you'll see one in here because the case is okay with that, but that's what they have to be parked in the no, bro. Okay. I'll be safer. Alright, you're on your last night. You know, like it's, it's after one o'clock. Last stretch. Yeah. Thank you. 
I actually went to where I was, which was the mental hospital, um, without any shoes because DSS is kind of my payee right now and they haven't really granted me the money to get a pair of shoes yet. <laughs> well, hopefully you get yourself somebody.
thank you. Um, I'm just going to take Gregory because he knows where it is. The okay. other boys are going to go down to the correct film or the river or whatever. Okay. Oh my gosh. So the security guard, all that wanted to do was because he has word that my son carry knives. So I said, do it. And I'm so glad to see Warden. He's out of the hospital. Still has no shoes. Somebody questioned about it and he told the lady, well, social services has control of all my money and they haven't issued me shoes as of yet. He's in there in his socks. Jennifer. In there? In there in his socks. He just got released from the mental health hospital. In there in his socks. And he explained to the lady and then the guard speaks up and says, they'll get you some shoes. And I looked at the guard and I said, no, they're not. That's why he doesn't have any already. <laughs> this fucking douche. Whole county's trash. He still has no shoes. Because they threw him away when they took him to the hospital for pneumonia. Jennifer doing with all these people's money? Why can't that kid have shoes? Where's my child support? It's like $30,000 they owe me in child support. I heard somebody just got fired over there for embezzlement. That wasn't in the paper. Oh, the lady that's over there wanting to talk about Warden's case, she's over there waiting for her. Mm -hmm. Hi. Warden's caseworker is over there waiting for you for an appointment. Warden's new caseworker, she's over there waiting for you for an appointment. Okay. Everybody in the office is the best people you have heard. Yeah, I walked back in before, but she won't no. Awesome. We're here at the shelter to get the phone we forgot. And here we go. And no, it's not us. We weren't even here. So I'm glad we went ahead and cleaned this whole kitchen like we did. Yep. Told you. And that's what that little frame is because my dad did construction, the same city, shitty kind of construction. Um, Mr. Gadget does in Walton, Mrs. Beth. This is what they do. This is the wonderful job they do. And this would have been all over our belongings if we did not come back and clean all of our stuff. Thank God. Good job, maintenance. Wonderful. Excuse me, you got your phone? But they're out here fucking around doing dick. I don't know why. I'm ready. Anybody going to investigate that? 
I told you. Anybody gonna replace my shades? Thank you. Ha 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 ha, she goes. Ha ha ha. No, I was just over there and asked. Ha ha ha. Lady of the house, huh? She's a lady of all birds. I was told by Amanda and, and Tracy Danielle when we were supposed to be going over to Stanford. Nobody's been there in years. It's all dusty, this and that. No, it wasn't. Dirty dishes in the sink, food in the fridge. No, it wasn't. Why does Gordy Faulkner think that? Jennifer and Mel are married. And I sounded like a retard every time I talked to somebody. And you thought, you guys thought I was making stuff up and dumb. Because I didn't know until somebody corrected me. No, he's married to Tina in finance. Over at Delaware Opportunities. Well, why do the neighbors in Stanford think that they're married? What the fuck are they doing over there to make the people think that they're married? In that, in the um, foster care home that was supposed to be empty since COVID. That was supposed to be all dusty. No, it wasn't. <clears throat> so the article 10 petition that we talked about well when it came with me to talk to you about that got filed so you'll probably get served with it over the next couple of days because court is on Thursday at 10 do you want me to come pick you up for court I don't know how else I'm supposed to get there so I didn't want you to be caught off guard that the sheriffs will probably come serve you with the paperwork at the hotel. I already told you, station. fill out the paperwork for foster care. De Joelle is right. I cannot take care of these kids in the places that are available for a poor person to rent. I'm going to have to look for a one-bedroom place, and I need to look for someone to take care of me. I don't know what else you guys want me to do. At this point, the petition that we filed isn't asking for foster care. It's asking for court-ordered services, basically, that you are, would, we're looking for court orders to say that you work with us and follow recommendations. We're not asking for No, I'm not. I'm not doing your drug and alcohol. I have no reason. I'm not going over to your mental health here in Walton. I have, no. No. File the paperwork. I don't know how many times I need to say it. I have to have back surgery. That's what needs to happen. I'm not going to go through your funding bullshit because, no. I, if I want to know where my child support is. I can't answer that for you. I know, I and nobody you know over that. there will help. But, but you'll tell them my business, why I can't have, why I can't work with Daniel Tracy. I don't know anyone that would be able to work with that Patrick Starr. When she looks at you like she's retarded and doesn't have any idea what you're talking about. But her plausible deniability is just perfect with that stupid look on her face. I didn't know. Are you still not willing to move forward at all with the Sydney apartment because they did say... I'm not yeah. willing to work forward to the Sydney apartment. Um, the kids and I just got these. But if I'm not looking for a three bedroom, then I'll look for a one. I need to have back surgery. Just like Warden needed shoes. You people have a problem over there and not listening to what's going on with people's circumstances. You're, You're getting, you tried to take my goddamn drug test over without even handling the property. You know how many people's drug tests over here are messed with because of that? I hear about it all the time, Diane. You're part of the problem. 